Hello, this is IC Control's quick start guide for CO2 measurement. First thing what you want to do is you want to place your can upside down, trying to align the center of the can with the black rubber seal. Next, you're going to press the lock plates, slowly lower it down. You can adjust the can to the center. Now you're going to hold the lock plates and pierce the can quickly and forcefully. Once it's been pierced, you're going to start shaking the can. And as you'll notice, the pressure gauge is going to start to rise. You shake the can until the pressure gauge stops rising and reaches its maximum point. Now for optimal measurement, you'll want to shake the can for a lot longer. Um, next, you're going to lower the thermometer. Make sure you don't hit the bottom of the can because it can pierce it. You're going to record this temperature. Once recorded, you're going to turn the whitey valve, this black valve right here, and bleed off the pressure from the can into a waste bucket. Once you're done that, you're going to take your pressure and temperature reading and look at the back of IC Control's CO2 quick start guide to reference of volumes of CO2 uh, in beer and that is where you'll be able to find your carbonation.